Hello everybody and welcome back. This is ZDS here bringing you part four of my Pokemon Sword Let's Play. So it's a new day. Um, I recorded till about almost one o'clock in the morning last night. And I think that was a bit much. Ugh. <sighs> also, it took fucking like five hours to upload part one at the time of this recording. Um, but uh, this episode is primarily going to be focused on uh, grabbing some shit that I missed. I actually started another playthrough on one of my separate files on my Switch, and I'm not quite at this point yet, uh, but I'm gonna go backtrack a little bit to uh, take care of some other shit. There's a TM I missed and some other little things like that. I also wanna catch some more Pokemon as well since I have plenty of Pokeballs now. I really hope she doesn't fucking railroad me right now because I wanna go back to the wild area and actually See if I can challenge something. Being held in most mos, mo, moto soak, moto stoke. Lift over there to get to the stadium. Okay. Yeah, sure. That's a big ass rock snake. Oh, that's pretty. She even throws her fucking hair. That's cute. Swing by the shots while I'm here. Don't forget to register at the stadium. Okay. I just, I get, I get vibes. I get vibes, and I will ignore those vibes because I'm weird. All right, so. I was going to do some level grinding before I recorded this video, but given the fact that there was a little bit of plot in my way, I had to kind of fucking start the video anyway, so. Let's go ahead and try to, I guess, do some grinding. Um, for the most part at this moment, I'm gonna actually, oh, hi, Pancham. I don't want you. Uh, what is that? That's a skitty, right? No, that's a stuff. A lot of stuff. Oh, and they want to chase me, apparently. Oh, 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 that doesn't look safe. Hold on. I need to frickin' switch back to controls. Uh, I, I don't want that on, actually. Yeah, Auto save off, horizontal, regular. There we go. Okay. Wait, is that Zachu chasing me? Oh, thank God. Thought it was trying to chase me. Uh... Oh, that's a Galvantula. Oh, I forgot this isn't a fucking platform and I can't jump off that edge. Um, I'm, I'm going to go back and I'm going to catch some Pokemon. There's a Yamper I still want to catch. Uh, do I dare even try to challenge you? Oh. Looks like the Butterfree disappeared. I think it was afraid of me. Hold on. I'm going to challenge you. See if I can challenge you. Why are they running from me? Huh. Maybe it is too high a level. Oh, that's a Haunter. Some of these Pokemon I probably want to avoid. Hi, Wingle. There's a Tyrogue in there. This is an excellent addition to the game, though. And oh my god, there's scope. Look at that. It's a cliffside. There's actual scope in this game. Oh, that's how I zoom out. Okay. I didn't even notice that. I didn't even know I could zoom out. Oh, and yeah, the tree texture is kind of bland. Um, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. The rest of this game looks so fucking good by comparison that a little bit of tree nonsense doesn't really bother me all that much. And that's a bundle I don't want that. Yeah, I will be doing... I'm probably going to make this video a little bit extra long. Who are you? Okay, you're not important. All right. Okay, let me go back. Okay, well, how do I go back? I don't want to talk to you. Okay. Go back to the... That was fast. Okay. I'm not about to complain about that, but that was very fast. All right. So, a couple of things here. Uh, behind the professor's house... Um, actually, here I missed something, too. Oh, rare candy! Oh, nice! I didn't even know there were rare candies that early in the game. Uh, not the laboratory here, but behind the, behind the professor's house, 
There's the TM for payback. I want to go ahead and grab that. Got to be over this way, though. Okay, now, now I got used to the fucking rotating camera, and now I'm trying to rotate the analog stick again. Oh, boy. Uh, I don't want you. I don't care about you guys. I don't know what this is. Another fucking purloin. Look, I like Lyperd. I said that before, but that doesn't mean I want one. I will be uh, catching some randos, though, at some point. Uh, just for the... What is that? Gamer! Oh, there's also the, uh, the, the first route bug Pokemon that I didn't catch either. Again, I caught that in the separate playthrough. Oh, and you're female, thank you. Okay, I'm gonna swap out, I think, I think, though. Uh, maybe, uh, maybe Hound won't kill you. It shouldn't. I don't have great attack stat. Oh. Uh-oh. Now I be paralyzed. I'm the paralyzed, where I seem to be struck by you. I want to make you move because you're standing still. But your body matches what your eyes can do. I want to sue right through me on my way to you. <laughs> that was terrible. I probably got like five of those words wrong. I like that song, though. And the Naruto trees in the left. I still love that. Alrighty, now we have a Yampa. Ah! Uh, Squavit, I'm throwing in the box. Uh, actually, no, I'm gonna throw Zigzagoon in the box first. <coughs> so, yeah, as I mentioned last video, or two videos ago, I don't remember exactly which, uh, I'm gonna be sticking exclusively to a regional Pokemon for this playthrough. Um, I'm not gonna be using any previous gen Pokemon in the Let's Play. Unless it's for like an HM slave or something like that. So, here's hoping that everything goes correctly. Yeah, I caught a Gamper. Uh, that's a Squabbit. I want that. Little foxy thing. Uh, where is the bug? I want the bug. Where's the bug? I want the bug. Where's the bug? There's the buff. I want the buff. Uh, hoo hoo. Okay, I never encountered this in the game yet. Um. Yeah, I don't want to catch any of the fucking previous gen Pokemon, even for the sake of possibly doing, uh, the new. I guess the new Wonder Trade thing. Also, I still cannot get over the fact that the water looks like water. My best friend, when I mentioned it to him the other day, told her today, said something about, like, well, yeah, of course, it's on a fucking HD console and stuff. And I'm like, yeah, but for Pokemon, that's a big fucking deal. Well, let's see if I can catch something. I fucked up last time. Waiting patiently, waiting patiently. Mine. Probably a Magikarp. And what do you know? It's a fucking Magikarp. I like Gyarados, but I already have my water type. I was hoping it was something different. Yeah, don't expect, uh, just a random point to bring up. Do not expect me to go fast through this Let's Play. I'm not going to. This is gonna be a long one. But yeah, back here behind the fence is a Payback TM machine. And I believe I have two Pokemon that can learn that right now. At least two. Uh, three, actually. So Choodle can learn it, but Choodle already has Bite. Rookity can learn it, though. She has Power Trip, which... Either stats are raised to greater than most power. Okay, so that's actually not a great move. Um, but with Home Claws, it would actually be pretty effective. Uh, I, actually, I think I'll forgo that for now. Uh, so yeah, not much in the way of good uh, TM options here. But Yamper can learn Swift, so I'll give her that. What is Yamper's stats, anyway? Gentle nature. 
I have no idea what this thing turns into. I've still, for the most part, been keeping the spoilers to a minimum. Although I do know about the fucking third legendary for the game. Eternatus. And holy Christ, that thing is fucking huge. There's the bug. Hello, blip bug. Blip bug. Please be female. Yay! Uh, I am worried about killing you, though. Because you are pretty weak. Yamper? Could be able to paralyze it. Although Yamper is pretty much half dead, though. More than half dead, actually. I don't know what that thing's gonna struggle bug. Please don't kill me. So goddamn close there. Okay, bag. Ocean. Heal. Heal my little corgi puppy dog thingy with Thunderbutt. I think Struggle Bug is all that thing knows right now. I'm just really curious what that thing turns into. Yeah, keep using your bug of struggles. I'll just paralyze you. Oh, that did a lot less than I was expecting. Uh, ba, ba, ba. do it again, I guess? <laughs> I don't know, honestly. Okay, struggle bug again. You, Yeah, that's all you've got, isn't it? Well, it's better than the fucking normal regional bug types only having tackle. So I guess I can't complain too much. Even though it's still in the green, paralysis should uh, cover the slack there. Three, and click. I like... It's a little bit added detail to the Pokeballs. I like that a lot. All right, so I got two of the Pokemon that I was looking for. I'm gonna put the little buggy buggy girl in my party. Uh, I'm gonna put Squavit uh, back in the fucking uh, PC. Okay. So I think that's for the most part everything that I'm currently missing. Uh, as far as new Pokemon are concerned. I could be wrong on that, but I'm pretty sure it's a safe assumption. Oh, also, real quick. Uh, I didn't even notice this until I did uh, my other playthrough. Uh, but casual controls allow me to play the game with, my, with one hand. So right now I'm using the right analog stick to move. I'm actually glad that's an option, but also surprised that it's an option. Ah. No. Oh, hold on. I can also just do my left hand, too. I played Pokemon a lot like that when I was a kid. What are you? What are you? Why do you look all glowy? That one looks all glowy for some reason. Uh, why do you look blowy? I don't get it. Well, I'm going to catch you just in case you were mattering for some reason. Oh, and it took me reviewing my freaking Pokemon to figure out that uh, Rookity is actually a pure flying type. Making it the only pure flying type outside of Tornadus. Which I think is actually pretty cool, because I'm really tired of normal flying types, for God's sake. Okay. Well, let's see exactly what is special about this one. Timid nature. What's my other Nicket? It's level 9. But I do like the nature of this one better. Oh, what is... What the hell is W? Huh? Uh... What is W? What is W? I gotta figure that out. I don't get what that means. Okay, so I gotta heal. I'm gonna try my damnedest to do some grinding once I get back to the wild area. I don't think I can go in here yet. 
Oh, I don't have to go in. She just has it. Okay. That seems at least. I do kind of want to get something at the apparel, apparel shop, but I think it'd be best if I stay away from that until I have some more money. If anything is to, if the uh, X and Y and Sun and Moon or anything to go by, when it comes to the apparel shop, it's probably best that I wait until I have a couple hundred thousand poke dollars. It'll make it easier to get what I need. Uh, next Pokemon I'm probably going to replace is going to be Choodle, if I can find something that has a different type. Because I don't usually like having overlapping types. Pokeball. Get 11 of those. Oh, and I got a Premier Ball. Cool. I'm glad that's still a thing. I get to fucking make, make sure I have 20 potions. And for the sake of consistency... Oh, 10 is probably too many. I'll just, I'll get three. Just for the moment. And I'm definitely going to use that rare candy on my freaking, uh, Sobble once it gets to about level 15 or so. I don't know exactly what level it evolves at, but I think it's probably 16. It's either 16 or 17. I doubt it'd be 18. All right. That is really quick. I like that. I'm really surprised that I didn't realize that sooner. Because last video, it could have helped me from freaking dying in the middle of the wild area. Okay. Alrighty then. Let us begin our journey. Hold on. Oh, I can't, uh... Okay. So apparently, I can't actually do the free-roaming camera if I have casual controls on. Duly noted. Okay. There we go. That's fine. It's okay to fucking play with two hands. Oh. Hello, Onyx. We meet again. As long as you don't use Rock Slide, I should Oko you with this water boosted water pulse. Alright. We're trying it one more time. Okay, Screech, and I have Rain Boosted, four times weak, Stab Water Pulse. If this doesn't kill it, I don't know what will. Uh, uh, oh, are you kidding me? Curse, use curse. Okay, that's fine. Dragon Breath shouldn't do much, right? Oh, oh god. That was more than I expected. But, you're dead. Awesome. Ha ha ha! Level 26, my foot. 477 experience. Good God, half my all my entire team leveled up at least once. Some of them even leveled up twice. Who wants to learn that? Oh, Naked Duck. Torment, goodbye. Okay, so that was actually really freaking good. That sounds like a really good way to grind, actually. So, um, I should be able to evolve Sobble, like, after one more of those. I'll use two potions just to make sure I'm fully healed. And I'll search for another frickin' Onyx. If I can find another Onyx in the rainy area, should be fine. I don't think it's going to appear next to the trees, though. Let's see here. I'm going to stay away from those frickin' glowing light spears to the sky, though. That one's a Gigantamax one, I'm almost positive. Oh, hi, Pangaro. I'm staying well away from your ass. You're probably level 35 or something. Way above my pay grade. Uh, let's see. What else we got? Anything else coming around? No? No random pop-ups here? There's a hoot hoot, another hoot hoot, another hoot hoot. Three of them. Anything else? High Rogue. A oh, Nuzleaf. Okay, that's neat. Not gonna bother with you, though. It's over here. More Hoo Hoots. What's that? Oh, a bunch of Oddishes. Okay, that's neat. Oh, I see a glowy thing. Tiny Mushroom. 
Nuzleaf, Nuzleaf. Wait a minute. I have Orin Berries. So why don't I just equip one? Whoops, that's not what I want to do. Give it to it. Okay. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm not going near you, buddy boy. Fancy apple. Huh. Another fancy apple. There, and a third fancy apple. Okay. I'm going away from you. And that glowy purple death spear that reminds me of the frickin' malice from Breath of the Wild. I'm not going near that thing right now. Oh, hi, Shift. Whoa, Shift Tree. Okay, that's a first. I don't think any other game in the series has allowed you to catch a frickin' Shift Tree in the wild before. That's actually really cool. I like that. I'm liking a lot of what I'm seeing, man. I mean... It's funny the difference it makes from complaining about the game before it comes out to actually playing the game once it has. Wait, is it snowing? Why is it snowing? It was clear over there, raining over there, and now it's snowing over here. Oh, annoy that. That's neat. Doesn't want any part of me, though. Duskull, Delibird. Oh, that Delibird's coming after me. Some of the Pokemon seem to be a little bit more timid than others. Others, like the ghost types, apparently, like to hunt after you. Oh, going away from you, going away from you, bye. <laughs> Delibird again, Drifoon, 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 Delibirds. A big-ass tower, I guess? Why does this Delibird want to kill me? Uh, ooh, hold on. Whoa. Whoa, okay. What's going on? Okay, there we go. Camera was getting all weird. Hi, Glalie, you are level 40. Oh, there's vanilla over there. That's neat. I, whoa! <laughs> I just turned around faster. I am really liking this wild area right now. This is pretty fucking cool. Kind of something they probably, whoa! Holy crap, Oli, going away from you. <laughs> I was expecting level some level team something, not level 30. Max Revive is helpful though. Thank you. Uh 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 need to get out of here. This is not good for my health. Oh hi Glaley again! <laughs> this is some serious Xenoblade frickin' two vibes on my ass, man. Oh god. Oh that's a snow run. Okay. I was just trying to see what that yellow thing in the grass was. Another Vanillite. You know, I wonder, like, with this new feature where you can actually see the Pokemon appear before you even go into the grass, does that mean that we'll be able to, like, see if they're shiny before we get them? Hmm. Okay, that one's not active, so thank God. I'm gonna go back across the bridge here. <clears throat> A Vanilux and a... Whoa! Ha! Hi, Gyarados! Hi! <coughs> you're, 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 you're not what I need to fight right now. I have a level 9 freaking electric type against a... Probably in its 30s freaking water type. Oh, Palpito. No thank you. I need to go back to the rainy area and find more Onyxes. Hi, Ninjask. You were probably very fast and very scary. Oh, P Dove. Come on, give me a frickin' Onyx here, please. That is a Pelper. That is not what I desire right now. Another P Dove. I don't want to fight you. Actually, you know what? I'm curious as to how much experience that thing will give me, if it's a decent level. Let's see. A wild pit of here. What level are you? Oh, you're only level seven, okay. 
I was expecting like level 20 or something. But that's not worth my time. Where was the other onyx that I found? I think it was over this way, right? No. This way more? I mostly just want to grind onyx because it's the easiest thing for me to two hit KO right now. With the rain and having a water type with a pretty decently powerful water move, I can level up Sobble to its evolution probably after one or two more encounters with it. I don't particularly want to bother with the weaklings right now. I don't think I'm even going to try any of the Dynamax things right now. I frankly don't even know if I can. I don't think I can Dynamax. Uh, should I try you? I'll try you. You're probably level 35 or something, God forbid. Oh, a very strong looking Haunter. What does very strong mean here? 31. Well then. Okay, Spike won't do anything until I hit you. Confuse it? Ooh. That did next to nothing. Oh, great. Don't reduce it by more than... Okay, four. I guess that's not good, though. If I can catch it... Uh-oh. Holy moly. If I can catch it... Hold on. I have a normal type in my party, don't I? Actually, I don't think I do. Okay, confused. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, Pokemon. I do not have a normal type in my party. I'm really regretting putting the other fucker in the box now. Uh, don't want to lose Sobble. And if it hits me with another frickin' uh, Nightshade, I'm dead. I'd rather sacrifice Nickit, swap out for a free Pokemon. You hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, block. I'm dead. Even at my low level, it doesn't matter. I really should have kept that fucker in my party. Had I known there were Haunter, I would have done that. Uh, Choodle, I guess? Okay, so I'm just gonna try to catch this thing. Wait, what? It won't let its guard... Oh, that's wonderful. You spite. Or hit yourself, that works too. I have no problem with that. Okay, hit yourself one more time, please. For the love of God, hit yourself one more time. Just once, that's all I need. Fuck. Oh, well, spite's fine. So apparently I can't catch the overleveled bastards, which is kind of unfair. Hey, use spite again, please. Or hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Block. Block! Well, that didn't work. Well, shit. I've got it very low, though, now, so I need to try to do something to this thing. Oh, that was not a good choice. That was not a good choice. And I cannot catch it at all. Uh, I guess I'll heal up Sobble then and sacrifice Blitplug. Or it can use Curse and kill itself. <laughs> That'll work too. Alright, let's see what we gain for that one. Whoa! 1100 for freaking Blitbug. Way to go there, bud. I don't want Fury Attack. Amber's 11. Bite. I'll take care of that. Go wait. Goodbye. Dang. My Pokemon are gaining levels pretty fucking fast with this method. This is awesome. Oh. Lip Bug's evolving. What's it going to evolve into? Let's see for ourselves. Oh. Huh. It kind of looks like an origami thing. Uh, like one of those, uh, fortune thingies, whatever the hell they're called. 
Wait, did that say psychic? Oh! It's a psychic type! Okay, that's a first. I don't think there's any other bug psychic type Pokemon out there. Okay, uh... So I'm gonna make this episode long, I guess, because it's gonna be mostly grinding right now. I really wanna get uh, most of my party pretty decent level before I head back to town. That's on the capture now. I wish I could run faster than this. Just specifically for like the wild areas. So I'll just go ahead back to the station real fast, heal up. <laughs> it's pretty convenient actually. I don't have to go too far to heal. Now, in case I find another Haunter, I'm going to put Choodle back in my party and switch it out for or the, the fucking... Sorry, not Choodle. Uh, I'm going to take Choodle out of my party and put back Squibbit. <clears throat> Squibbit, whatever the... I can never freaking remember how to pronounce that damn thing. Squabbit, okay. I'll swap back out for that. Er, uh, yeah, that'll work. I would put Zig back in the party, but eh. Not particularly interested in leveling up Zig Zagoon right now. So, this is actually really good. I'm actually... Ugh, fuck. I I'm so surprised that I'm taking back so many of my previous statements for this game. Because there's so many things about the game that's already impressing me, and I've only been playing it for a day and a half. Right, let's see if I get another freaking Haunter, or not Haunter. Well, yeah, Haunter or an Onyx. Those are my two best bets right now. If I just put out freaking Squabbit, then Haunter can't do jack diddly squat to me. That is a Diggersby. Even with Water Pulse and the Rain, that's not going to freaking even half code the damn thing. Where exactly are the fucking uh, onyxes? I'm guessing they're a bit rarer than the rest of them or something? I don't know. It's a little bit hard to tell. Huh. That is a Dynamax, and I don't think I'm... I, yeah, I'm definitely not ready yet. I want to do a Dynamax, but I feel like I'm going to get my ass collectively handed to me in about 10 seconds if I do, so... I'd rather not die? That would be my preference. I would appreciate the not the not death. Pelipper. Okay, so I'm noticing the pattern now. Pelipper and... Uh... Yeah, some of them are spawning in the exact same places, so that means Onyx should spawn in the same place if it's following the rules of the rest of them. But it's just not spawning. I mean, again, I can go with Haunter. That's an easy fix as well, but... I kind of want to kill a damn Onyx right now. Not sure where the rain ends exactly. I don't think I went this way last time. Okay, so that's a bunch of rock and ground types over here. Maybe I'm in the right spot? Oh, well, there's Pelipper again. Uh, let's go this way. Oh, fancy apple? Nope, tiny mushroom. Oop, another one? Oh no, that was just my feet. Okay. That's that scary frickin' ninja ass that likes to hunt me. Huh. Why is there no Onyx around here? What is this? Tiny Mushroom, Tiny Mushroom. There's a Pelipper again. Let's go straight, I guess? Huh. 
Now that's Butterfree. It doesn't want to fight me. I think I can... Maybe I can sneak up on those ones that don't want to fight. I haven't tried that yet. You know what? Actually, um... Yeah, I'm actually going to go ahead and cut the video here simply because my first video took so bloody long to upload. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and call it an episode here. The next video, I'm just going to do more some, some more grinding. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like the channel, links to my Twitter and my Patreon will be in the description below, so I have the ability to. And until next time, this has been ZDS, making YouTube for fun one video at a time, and I will check you guys in the next video.